Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel and today we are going to be doing a review of TJ the Brick Wright's Naboo Starfighter Mock or alternative build if you will because all of the pieces from this are from the uh, Racecrest Micro Fighter very good set I recommend I got this set over Easter when I got the uh, Lego Star Wars the Skywalker Saga game because it was on discount at Tesco Love Tesco <laughs> Anyway, so uh, In general terms of this set very good uh, Set I meant to say mock you can see how good it is. I forgot it was a mock Anyway, so it's a very good mock um, I wouldn't be surprised if Lego actually revealed this because it's the Naboo Starfighter. They've made a full scale one. We need a smaller one. Like, especially with Mandalorian Season 3 coming out, we aren't going to have the Razor Crest. So, we need to have this as a micro fighter. Come on, Lego. Come on. <laughs> anyway, very good. To say that it's a mock, uh, there's only one, well, two issues that I have with it. This part here, unstable. That's it. Well, also, with this, you, you can see there's four studs there. Uh, he has to sit on the first two studs there. And those last two uh, are used for the backpack. Not backpack, jetpack. Um, so, uh, it has the new stud shooters, which I've never had in a Lego set before. Uh, very good quality. Uh, yeah, I would say these are better than the ones before. Uh, let me just go get some extra studs, just in case I feel like shooting it again. Yeah, I do. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, I didn't need to get the extra studs. Anyways, so, um, very, very high quality. Um, um, yeah. So, I feel like we do need to have a set of this. Uh, this is completely unscripted, by the way, so you're going to hear a lot of umming and ahhing. Oh, that's not going in. Okay, there it is. Uh, as you can see, it's got this, like, in the actual set... It can hold the Mandalorian's gun. And that just fell off, wowzers. Uh, <laughs> no, it can hold the Mandalorian's gun. Uh, they use a small gun in this. Uh, I actually haven't had a Mandalorian set before this one. And comparing it to the actual build, I much prefer this one. Uh, like, it's no, not anything bad to the set it's just that it doesn't look as accurate as it could be there's my only issue um yeah uh also with since as i said before i've got the skywalker saga now so once i finish the game prepare for a review uh a lot of what i have to say with the actual game very good but that's for a later date uh, anyway, if you liked this video, found it informative, uh, subscribe to my channel, subscribe to, uh, um, TJ the Brickwright, because he will make tons more mocks like this, I hope. Yeah, I will leave the link to his channel in the, des in the description, and a link to the instructions for this in the description. So, I hope you enjoyed this quick little five minute video, probably on the longer side of videos I make, because <laughs> there are any short things, and I might, I might start working on a new animation at some point, because this set, not set, mark would make it really, it just makes it a lot easier to, for Star Wars stuff, like, because I can add a piece on to the bottom of this to make it easier to slide around because when you slide it it doesn't slide much and it just makes that easier for animation so yeah uh hope you've enjoyed the video and 